Namaste. Hare Krishna. You have just seen the video, where a person silently ties crackers to the dog's tail, while the dog is unaware. The person then lights up the crackers, which frightens and hurts the dog. Seeing this, I became furious. Many people play mischievously with animals. Like hitting birds with a catapult. Pelting stones on cows, dogs or cats on the road. These people enjoy hurting these animals. This is completely wrong. Also, they poach rhinos for their horns and sell them. They also shoot and kill elephants for their tusks. Also, they hurt cows badly for its meat when it is still alive. If you are treated like that, would you feel okay? You know about karma. If you play mischievously with animals, your uncomfortable karma is stored. And in future, either in this life or in the afterlife, you will be punished. If someone is found pelting stones on dogs on the road, they must be fined. If they strangle or hurt cats and other animals, they must be jailed. We must not play with animals as God has given them life. Humans have a separate path. Insects, animals and birds have their own paths. But, in case animals, like a dog attacks us, we know we can use a stick. Or if a lion attacks us, we can use a gun or knife or stone to protect ourselves. It is important to protect ourselves. But you should never play or hurt dogs with stones or crackers for no reason. You must respect the rights of the animals. We are lucky that God made us humans with a soul. I request those who love Lord Krishna or any God not to trouble the animals and change your mindset and also spread awareness to other people about discourage cruelty to animals. If you are cruel to animals, then you are like the devil. I request for your cooperation 
to support these animals. Be happy with nature. Animals and birds. Be happy with Lord Krishna or any god. Hope you will be kind hearted. And give love to animals. Namaste. Hare Krishna. Namaste. Hindus, Jains, Buddhists. Follow Ahimsa. Which means, we should not hurt others. They must follow non-violence. You must explain to them that they have karmic reactions. So they have to take care of their actions. They must realize it and be careful. Explain all this to them. You must explain that all living beings like humans, animals, birds, insects, snakes, fish, and all have a soul. So, you should not play and be violent towards them. Because they have a soul. Also, Lord Krishna has mentioned about Super Soul. So when you are cruel to animals, as the Super Soul Lord Krishna will witness, and store your karma. After death, your soul will have a problem. So you must be careful with your actions. My advice to you all is to practice ahimsa. Namaste.